27 year old actress Crisan Pereira takes a flight to Sharjah for an audition but gets arrested in a narcotics case. Basically she was conned and in the latest the Mumbai crime branch on Monday arrested two persons for allegedly framing Crisan. The case is not just another scam case. Instead the probe has revealed that Pereira who has appeared in movies like Sadak 2 and Batla House was framed by one of the arrested Anthony Paul who wanted to get back at her mother over a personal issue. So what exactly happened? Krishan's mother Pramila received a message on March 23rd that claimed to help her daughter get good roles. Krishan then spoke to the person directly who identified himself as Ravi and claimed to have a talent management company. He told her to attend an audition in Sharjah for a web series. A day before she was to leave on April 1, Ravi met Pereira in a hotel and gave her a memento to hand over to someone in Sharjah. He said that a person would receive her at Sharjah airport and hotel rooms were booked. However, on April 1 when Pereira reached the Sharjah airport, there was no one to receive her and neither were any hotel bookings made. When she called her father, he realized that she has been duped. And when she told him about the memento given by Ravi, he got suspicious and told her to approach the police. When she went to Sharjah police, they checked the memento and found ganja and opium hidden inside. following which they arrested Pereira the family then approached police stations in the city where initially no action was taken eventually the mumbai crime branch unit x began investigation and registered an fir at bakola police station in the investigation it was revealed that one accused was anthony paul a bakery owner whose sister resided in the same building as the pereiras paul had a fight with krishan's mother pramila twice one during covid over the issue of wearing a mask and second time over her dog barking interestingly this is not the first time paul duped someone after sending people abroad by hiding drugs in their luggage paul would call up sharjah airport police and tip them off about the person carrying drugs then he would try to get money from the victim's family saying that he knows lawyers in sharjah even in the case of pereira he demanded rupees 80 lakh from her mother to get her daughter released In addition to Pereira, Paul had also tried to frame four others, one of whom is lodged in Sharjah prison. The Mumbai police is hopeful of getting Pereira back after they send a copy of the FIR to Sharjah through diplomatic channels.